hello everyone today we are going to see about a simultaneous differential equation with constant coefficient here the simultaneous differential equation can be identified as here the number of unknown value and the number of variables are same for example here x and y are the unknown values here and that number of variables also x and y here uh, that common dependent value is t so the number of unknown and the number of variables are same in a simultaneous differential equations so or the problem is dx by dt plus 2y equal to minus sin x and uh, dy by dt minus 2x equal to cos t so first we consider this as a first equation and second one as a second equation so here by using our normal method solving elimination method we solve our two equations and find our x and y values here here having a differential equation in the question differential form so uh, for according to that we have to differentiate first one uh, first equation or second equation i would like to take the first equation that is dx by dt plus 2y equal to minus sin t here also having a uh, dy by dt if we differentiate if i differentiate this y term means i get dy by dt so uh, for um, equating i differentiate the first term so if i differentiate means this will be differentiate means we get d square x by dt square plus 2 into dy by dt equal to and here minus and sin x can be written uh, differentiate means we get cos t so this we consider as a third equation and and this can be written as according to this order so um 2 2x plus dy by dt equal to cos t so uh, for cos t so if we cancel the common term means taking here minus in all the terms and cancel means we get the terms as a d square x by dt square plus this will be changed as plus so plus 4x equal to and if we add these term means we get minus 3 cos t so this can be written as a normal form can be written as uh, d by dt square can be written as d square by dt square can be written as d square x plus 4x equal to minus 3 cos t so according to that by normal method we use that auxiliary find that auxiliary equation and complementary function so uh, if we want to find the auxiliary equation means we instead of d we put m so m square plus 4 equal to 0 and m square equal to minus 4 and if we take a root means m value is plus or minus 4 right so our complementary function will become as x here why we have chosen x means because uh, here we taken x as a common term in that so x equal to a cos 2t according to t variable so x equal to a cos 2t plus b sin 2t and um, we find out our complementary function but we have a particular integral that particular integral is uh, my particular integral equal to minus 3 cos t divided by this term so taking x as common means we get d square plus 4 so put here a d square because it is in the form of trigonometric and it can be a d square can be written as minus 1 because a d square can be written as minus a square so here a minus a is nothing but 1 so a is nothing but 1 so minus 1 here d square instead of d square we put minus 1 so if we substitute in the term means we get minus 3 cos t divided by 3 and if we cancel means we get as minus cos t so our particular integral value is minus 3 minus cos t and the general solution will become as adding our complementary function and our particular integral that will become as x equal to a cos 2t plus b sin 2t so we find it out find it our x value in some simultaneous differential equation we not only find uh, one value we have to find the two values that is um, in a given question so uh, according to that uh, if i differentiate these two means i get dx by dt so why i differentiate means instead of dx by dt here i easily substitute our differentiated terms for easy solving so um, i choose that method or otherwise we can integrate uh, other forms 
so um, if we differentiate these term means we get dx by dt equal to and here 2 will become as here 2a and cos t can be written as minus sin 2t plus and here also 2b sin t can be written sin 2t can be written as cos 2t plus uh, here uh, minus cos t here minus and co if we differentiate cos t means minus sin t so minus minus plus sin t so our dx will be value will become as here and if we substitute in this term that is instead of uh, dx by dt we substitute that minus 2 sin 2t um, plus uh, 2b cos t plus sin t and if we substitute means I took that 2y as here and taking this as in the right hand side means so if here having this values and if I take that values in the right hand side means this goes to right means also plus so 2a sin 2t and it will become minus because we are taking to right hand side so minus 2b cos t minus here plus having so minus sin t and one more sin t is already minus sin t is already having in the question so minus sin t then wh what I do if we I multiplied by 2 the whole terms means we get I get that y equal to a sin 2t minus b cos 2t minus sin t this is the solution for this whole question we find it out our x and y value so this is the solution hope you all understand and thank you for watching keep supporting